Bootstrap today has delivered our full year financial results for FY24. Very resilient result. $1.34 billion of underlying EBIT, 11.9% return on invested capital. We've maintained a strong balance sheet, $364 million of net cash. And the board have reflected that resilience by increasing our share dividend from 50 cents per share per annum to 60 cents per share per annum and maintained our buyback. We have about $273 million a buyback that we'll continue to look at over the next 12 months. One of the great things about the Blue Scope story is we have a, a range of exciting projects within our portfolio that match our core competencies. So overseas, a deep bottlenecking opportunity at North Star, which will see us for 130 million US dollars increase the capacity of that facility by another 10%, another 300,000 tonnes of steel per annum. Uh, we're also working on the, the integrated supply chain in North America, looking at coupling North Star with our coatings business and providing a metal coated painted product to allow us to introduce colour bond in North America. Uh, and in Australia and New Zealand, again, a, a, a significant range of internal projects. The Blast Furnace Reline is progressing very well on time and on budget. We're building a new metal coating line in Western Sydney, which will support domestic growth of colour bond in Australia uh, and installing an electric arc furnace in New Zealand, which will reduce our emissions at that facility by 45%. We have a challenging outlook for the first half of FY25, a forecast underlying EBIT of $350 to $420 million is the range we've published. What we're seeing as we go into 25 is a convergence of headwinds from a global perspective that we haven't, haven't seen for some time. Uh, very strong production in Asia, large amounts of export are putting pressures on spreads. What that highlights is the importance of the resilience of the Blue Scope model, the fact that we're diversified across our portfolio in different regions, but also the fact that we've got great experience of dealing with the cyclical nature of the steel industry in the past. Our teams know how to ensure we've got the right cost base, how we deal with inflationary pressures in areas such as energy. So the teams across our businesses now are leaning into those cyclical conditions, bottom of the cycle conditions, working very hard to make sure our business is in the best possible shape it can be. We're getting fit, if you like, uh, and we know how to do this. We've done it before, and that's one of the great strengths of the Blue Scope team.